、えー、っとこ,れこれらのことのち、アシオソーはア,アガブとアガブビとハ,ハ,ハマレダナの子、ハマンを重んじ、これを昇進させて、自分と共にいるすべての大臣たちの上にその席を定めた。王の門のうちにいる王の自陣たちは皆ひざまずいてハマンに敬礼した。これは王が彼についてこうすることを命じたからである。しかしモルデカイはひざ,ひざまずかず、また礼拝しなかった。そこで王の門にいる自陣たちはモルデカイに向かってあなたはどうして王の命令に背くのかと言った。彼らは毎日モルデカイにこう言うけれども、聞き入れなかったので、このことが許,許されるかどうかを見ようと、これをハマンに告げた。なぜなら、モルデカイはすでに自分のユダヤ人であることを彼らに語ったからである。ハマンはモルデカイの、あはモルデカイのひまざ、ひ,のひ,ひざまずかず、また自分の礼拝しないのを見て、怒りに満たされたが、ただモルデカイだけを殺すことを、生きよい、潔しとしなかった。彼らはモルデカイの属する民をハマンに知らせたので、ハマンはアシリエスオソの国のうちにいるすべてのユダヤ人、すなわちモルデカイの属する民をことごとく滅ぼそうと分かった。アシリエスオの第12年の,の正月、すなわち2、3の月にハマンの前で、12月、すなわちアラルの月まで1日1日のため、一月一月のためにプ,プルすな,すなわちくじを投げさせた。そしてアマンはシリオソに行った。お国の各州にいる庶民のうちに知らされて別れ別れになっている一つの民がいます。その立法は他のすべての民のもとと異なり、また彼らは王の立法を守りません。戦友へ彼らは許しておくことは王のためになりません。もし王がよしとされるならば、彼らを滅ぼされ、せと、みことのりを書きください。そうすれば、私は、王のことを司る者たちの手に、銀、一万タラントを計り渡して、王の金庫に入れさせましょう。そこで、王は手から指輪を外し、アガブと、アガブ人と、は、はん、はんめだ、だたの子で、ユダヤ人の敵であるハマンに渡した。そして、王はハマンに行った。その銀は、あなたに与える。その民もまたあなたに与えるから良いと思うようにしなさい。そしてそこで正月13日に王の書記官を召し集められ、王の総督各州の知事及び庶民の司たちにハマンが命じたことをことごとく書き記した。すなわち各州に送る者にはその文字が用い、庶民に送る者にはその言語を用い、おのおのアシリオソウの名を持ってそれを書き、王の指輪を持ってそれに印をした。そして、九死を持って、その書を王の書集のに送り、12月すなわちアラヌの月の13日に、に火のうちにすべてのイラー人、若い者、老いた者、子供、女の別となくことをとこぼし、殺し、たやし、かつその家財を奪い取れと命じた。この文章を写し、写しを、みことのりとして、各州に伝え、すべての民に行使して、その日のために備えさせようとした。九州は王の命令により、急いで出て行った。この御事の縫いは、首都スサで発布された。時に王とハマンは座して、酒を飲んでいたが、スサの都は、慌て、まどわった。After these things did King Asherus promote Haman, the son of Hamedatha, The Agai and advanced him and set his seat above all the princes that were with him. And all the king's servants that were at the king's gate bow and, rever- and worshipped Haman, for the king had commanded concerning him. But Mordecai bowed not, nor did they give him worship. Then the king's servants, which were in the king's gate, said unto Mordecai, Why transgressest thou the king's commandment? And it came to pass when they spake daily unto him, he hearkened not unto them. That they told Haman to see whether Mordecai's matters would stand, for he had told them that he was a Jew. When Haman saw that Mordecai bowed not, nor did, did him worship, then Haman was full of wrath, and he, he thought scorn to lay hands on Mordecai alone, for they showed him the people of Mordecai, wherefore Haman sought to destroy all the Jews that were throughout the whole kingdom of Asherus, even the people of Mordecai. In the first month, that is, in the month of Nisan, in the twelfth year, 
of King Ashura's day cast pure, that is a lot before Haman from day to day, from mouth to mouth, into the twelfth mouth, that is the month Adar. And Haman said unto King Ashura's, There is a certain people scattered abroad and dispersed among the people in all the provinces of thy kingdom, and their laws are diverse from all people. Neither keep they the king's laws, therefore it is not for the king's prophet to suffer them. If it please the king, let it be written that they may be destroyed, that I will pay ten thousand talents of silver to the hands of those that have the charge of the business to bring it to the king's treasuries. And the king took the ring from his hand and gave it unto Haman, the son of Hamadath, the Amagite, the Jew's enemy. The king said unto Haman, The silver is given to thee, the people also, to do with them as it seemeth good to thee. Then were the king's scribes called on the thirteenth day of the first month, and there was written according to all that Ammon had commanded unto the king's lieutenants and to the governors that were over every province and to the rulers of every people of the every province according to the writing thereof and to every people after their language in the name of King Asherus uh, was it written and, and sealed with the king's ring and the letters were sent post by by post into all the king's province to destroy to kill and to perish all jews both young and old little children and women and one day even upon the thirteenth day of the twelfth month which is the month of adder to take the spoil of of them for a prey the copy of the writing for a commandment to be given in every province was published unto all people that they should be ready against the day the post went out being hastened by the king's commandment and the decree was given to shushan in that place and the king and haman sat down to drink but the city shushan was perplexed を知った時、そのこの者先、荒野の的へ、激しく叫んで、王の門の入り口まで行った。荒野の的では、王の門のうちに入ることはできなかできない殻である。すべて王の命令と御事の匂いを受けた。各州では、ユダヤ人のうち
。私と私の次女たちも同様に断食しましょう。そして私は立法に背くことですが、王のもとへ行きます。私がもし死ななければならないのなら死にます。モデカイは言ってエステルが常に自分の命じた通りに行った。When Mordecai perceived all that was done, Mordecai ran his clothes and put on sackcloth with ashes and went out into the midst of the city and cried with a loud bitter cry and came before the king's gate for none, none might enter into the gate clothed with sackcloth. In every province, Uh, whithersoever the king's commandment and his decree came, there was great mourning among the Jews, and fasting, and weeping, and wailing, and many lay in sackcloth and asses. So Esther's maids and her chamberlains came and told it to her. Then it was the queen, exce- then the, was the queen exceedingly grieved, and she sent raiment to clothe Mordecai, and to take away his sackcloth from him, but he received it not. Then the king called Esther of Hattuck,、uh, one of the king's chamberlains, whom he had appointed to attend upon her. And gave him a commandment to Mordecai to know what it was and why it was. So Hattach went forth to Mordecai onto the street of the city which was before the king's gate. And Mordecai told him all that had happened unto him, and the sum of the money that Haman had promised to pay the king's treasuries for the Jews to destroy them. And he gave him a copy of the writing of the decree that was given at Shushan to destroy them, to show unto Esther and to declare unto her, and to charge her that she should go. Unto the king to make supplication unto him to make a request before, before him for her people. And Hattach came and told Esther the words of Mordecai. Again, Esther spake unto Hattach and gave him a commandment unto Mordecai. All the king's servants and the people of the king's province to do know that whatsoever man or woman shall come into the king into the inner court who is not called, there is one law of his, his to put him to death, except such to whom the king shall hold out. The golden scepter that he may live, but I have not seen, I've not been called to come in unto the king these thirty days. They told Mordecai Esther's words. Then Mordecai commanded to answer Esther Think not with thyself that thou shalt escape the king's house more than all the Jews. If thou altogether holdest thy peace at this time, there shall, there, then shall their enlargement and deliverance arise to the Jews from another place. But thou and thy father's house shall be destroyed. Who knoweth whether that thou art. Come to the kingdom for such a time as this. Then Esther bade them return Mordecai this answer Go together, all the Jews that are present in Shushan, and fast ye for me, and neither eat nor drink three days, night or day. Also, and I also and my maidens will fast likewise. And so will I go on in unto the king, which is not according to the law. And if I perish, I perish. So Mordecai went his way and did according to all that Esther had commanded him.